I'm sorry, but it's getting trash canned. And I usually don't do that. I usually don't do that. But you had a trash can that one. I'm sorry. What up, people? This is Bunjo. Today we're gonna go on a little food tour at the Brunin Mark. It's where you can buy a whole bunch of Arabic and different kinds of foods. We're gonna try everything there. Supposedly it's supposed to be budget friendly, so we're gonna see everything's around two euros. But we're at this park for Enzo. This giant pear, or yeah, a couple pears, three pears, avocados. I don't know what they are. But we're gonna let Enzo run around, Uba, and have a little fun. And then we're off to the Brunnen Market, Austria, Austria, Austria. Full of surprises, big city things going on. Look at this building though. It's like, I don't know, it's like a whole bunch of graffiti everywhere. It's magnificent. I like it here. This is the Bon Jo Show. This is not your show. He traded the 905 for Giovo. The Brunnen Mark, here we are, eh? Yeah. This is what it looks like, eh? Yeah? We don't have this in Croatia, do we? Yeah, so I think Mickey is a little bit uh, shocked a bit, eh? Disappointed, I would say. Disappointed? What do you mean? I wanted to eat. Yeah, we are eating. Oh, okay. We're, I think here, see the little stands? Oh, okay. okay. Now we get the leathers, the stands, and all that stuff. So let's go, eh? <laughs> she thought it was just all like uh, dry ingredients, basically. Yeah, she thought we had to cook. <laughs> she ain't cooking. <laughs> So, let's try some of these. You want to try some of these? Vegans? Everything. I think we're going to try some of these things, yeah? The kibe? Okay. And the shawarma. Shawarma teller, maybe. Uh, <laughs> uh, can we get a shawarma on... Shawarma the teller. Kibe? The first one? Teller? <laughs> kibe. <This> one. <laughs> yes, the first one. I'm sorry. You don't have to? Okay, no problem. We, we will see something else. The shawarma then, eh? Okay. Shawarma? One shawarma is good? One shawarma or potato. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. Potato or... What do you want on it? Potato? Uh, yeah, we'll get the teller one, yes. Like, uh, yeah, yes, perfect. Thank you. The kibe, eh? I've never heard of it. What is the kibe? Kibe is a pork roll with the meat. Inside, like a empanada or something, yes. yes. Ah, oh, so. perfect. I prefer markets like this. I like it. It's a little bit. This is like like when I went to Morocco. It's kind of like the same, like kind of cool. Like raw ingredients with the already cooked stuff. Look at this little stand. Are we eating here? That's nice. That's good. It's beautiful. <laughs> Are you excited? A shawarma is just almost like a chicken kebab, kind of, huh? I'd okay. say. Chicken kebab? I eat it. <laughs> I eat it. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> this is a uh, like tzatziki sauce. Yeah. Yeah. Try it. <laughs> Try it. It's not spicy, huh? No. Mm. You have to eat this shawarma. And this is oh, beef. This sauce is good. Yeah. But it's garlic. Huh? Yeah, garlic sauce. Try this? No. What is this? It's like beets or something. You go like this. That's good, no? I will grab mine. Yeah, you gotta have. Here, you want to try? Yeah. <laughs> Ladies, some more. Mm -hmm. That's a good one, huh? Better than kebab, huh? What do you think? The garlic sauce is good. 
it's a it's a little bit dark, it's spicy the garlic sauce. But this is. But this is good. I like this sauce. What is this sauce? This. I don't know. Black sauce. <laughs> I want to try this. Mickey is shook. <laughs> oh, no. Mickey is shook though, eh? Baby, that's a good one. That looks nice. It's an authentic market. Let's I'm, go. I don't know. I don't know. I will say like... Uh, the food is good though. You I'm lie. not too used to, to this culture. And I didn't expect this culture. Actually, I'm not too used to this culture. And I didn't expect this culture. So? But it's okay. Of course it's okay. Look at the Croatian. The Croatian flag, eh? Croatia, Hrvatska. <laughs> Wanna get a kipe here? Kipe? Oh, you don't like talking to them. You have everything here. You got all sorts of canned goods, perishables. You got fruits, you got veggies, you got hot eats, you got cool treats. That's great here. I love it. She's a little bit uh, timid. She's she never experienced something like this. Imagine her in Morocco or Thailand or something. Imagine you in Thailand or Vietnam. Jeez, son. She would be lost. <laughs> she would be lost. <laughs> she was so scared. But here, this is a Hofer. It's an Aldi. It's supposed to be the cheapest grocery store, but we're not going there. Probably not going to go to grocery stores again here. We got this, the Brunenmark, huh? The Brunenmark. Let's check it out. <laughs> <laughs> this is good? <laughs> Here, you want to try this one? Here. Here, let's try it. It's like falafel or something, eh? In the only hummus. Hummus. Wait. No, no, Oh, for the kid, yeah. <laughs> Here, Enzo. Here. Here. <laughs> he likes that. That's good. He's good. You got money? Yeah. Mmm. It's good. I wonder what's in this. I guess he doesn't speak. You speak English? <laughs> but he gave us one of these. You want to get a can of Coke too? Oh, we going, huh? But we are waiting for something. Yeah, we're waiting oh, for. Okay, yeah. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, he gave us. Uh, I don't even know what they're called. Oh, falafel. Oh, listen, Ben. I'm gonna have this. It's like a falafel with chickpeas, that's all. I think it's rice inside. No, chickpeas, I think. But this is a nice presentation, right? Beautiful presentation with this pink little thing that I don't know what it is, but it tastes good. Yeah, these. And, and this, this is, I didn't expect the sweet. It's shocked there, but it's, um, it's supposed to be like a Arabic empanada, kibe, kibe. Right. Right. Mm. Try this. <laughs> These things are good. But yeah, I don't know what it is. Sometimes it feels like I press the camera on and then it doesn't record. <laughs> it happened to me twice, so I'm gonna be like freaking Harold. Am I recording? But yeah, this is our second little item. It seems like everything's closing, no? Yes, that is at least five. What I thought you said it closed at nine. Five thirty, yeah, maybe these stands are open later, but Oh the food market, yeah. Mm. Uh, Cause it tastes like I've never tasted something like it. I don't know how to explain it. It's like just sweet. 
But like a different sweet. I don't know. I don't know if it's like a snack or a meal. Hmm. Very different. Here. Yeah. <laughs> Ciao, man. That was a beautiful one. We're going to try a skewers next, I think. And we're on to the next stand, just like that, huh? Ciao. <laughs> yeah, nice guy. Nice time. I don't think Mickey was digging it too much. Eh? When, because I was thinking that it was ground beef inside. It was. Like an empanada. But there is also nuts and sweet stuff. Yes. That I didn't recognize. <laughs> so, it caught you off. It caught you by surprise, kind of. Here, you want to push it? Sure, I'm on. Yeah, but I, I enjoyed it. It was just strange to get used to. It's weird. Yeah, but it wasn't bad. I say that it's bad, and it was that I'm not used to. Yes, exactly. Just not used to it. So we're here, we're trying this. The lamb kebab. You never had this, huh? Is this your first time? Lamb. Lamb. Come on. <laughs> Lamb's good, though. We like that. How you do it? <laughs> Uh, is it good stuff? Good, yeah, the best, super, eh? Super the, the, the number one? Number one. <laughs> good, uh, yeah. Yes, good. Yes, what, what is it called? Yeah. Lamb kebab, eh? Lamb kebab. Tomate, uh, uh, yes, it's good, yes. <laughs> yeah, we're excited. Uh, Syria. Syria? Syria, yeah. Yeah. Canadian. Canada, super. Nice. Argentine. <laughs> super. Yeah. Maradona. Yeah, Maradona. Maradona. Yes. We, we live in Croatia. 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 <laughs> but here's good too. <laughs> so we got the last piece to the puzzle. You want to peel the tinfoil back a little? The tinfoil? Yeah. Try that baby. Did you get some meat? How's that one? You like it? Honest. No? <laughs> mm. It's not so bad. Mm. I don't know. I'm gonna need another taste, but there's something in there that tastes like I don't know, I can't like weird. I don't like lamb. You don't like it? No? I don't like lamb in general. <laughs> yeah, it's not bad though. It tastes like barbecue, like fire. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Not my favorite. Least I thought that one was gonna be my favorite. Ended up being the worst one, maybe. The first one was the amazing. Yeah, first one was amazing. Very good. The last two were. I wouldn't get them again. Maybe. <laughs> Overall, this market was kind of fun, cool, different. What do you think? But now we need real food, huh? Yes, I don't know. What should we do now? I don't know. I'm not hungry, hungry, but. Uh, now you're hungry because you only ate a little bit, eh? Mm. I don't know. We can have a kebab somewhere. Yes, uh, right. Right here. No, near out the apartment anymore. What is it? Good Remember? one? Alright, yeah. The last one will be a kebab for this video. Yes, let's try it out. A kebab. And we'll check it out. Yeah, sometimes when you try like new things and you eat in front of like the owner that's being real nice and you know he gave us a free sample of something and when you do that you kind of feel obligated not to be, not to be like <coughs> and throw it on the floor, right? You know what I mean? Of course, because they wanted to sell. Yeah. It doesn't look like it's that busy. I don't know in summer, maybe it's different. Yeah, but, but I feel like it's only for locals. Yeah, like but the prices are not for locals. No. Because no. the first shawarma we pay five euros. That's pretty good. Oh. Some people might hate this, but our 
What do you think about the Brunin market overall? Is it a must visit if you're coming to Austria? I don't think so. I, I mean, if you want to see another side of the country, yes, because this is not what I expected. When I, I don't think about this part of the country when I think about Austria. Yeah, and I don't know. And uh, yeah, I don't think, I think it was kind of a, me, I was on the other hand, I was super excited for it. Yes. And it let me down because it was just like two little streets and... And also that I was maybe thinking like it was, it was full big. of street food. Yeah. But it's like... Uh, Three places. Some butchers. Yeah. Some places that they sell clothes, toys. And it's all the same stuff. Yeah. All the same stuff. There's only that one guy at the beginning that sold good food, the shawarma guy. The guy that was the shawarma, that, was, the shawarma was amazing, but this, I'm sorry, but it's getting trash canned. And I usually don't do that. I usually don't do that. But you had a trash can that one. I'm sorry. It tasted like puke, and I'm not even being mean. Like it literally tastes like puke a little bit. So I, I had to throw it. I tried to be honest, but hey, sometimes you get in trouble for being honest. Puke kebab. We change our last meal destination. We're gonna get a sausage, a street sausage, street meat. These sausages look gorgeous when we went by, so we're gonna try to get one. But look at this. Beautiful, eh? And there's the interspar. It's a whole section over here. Oh, it's right here, huh? All right, uh. I want this one, the bratwurst. The bratwurst, I think. Let's get the bratwurst. And a br and get a bratwurst, too. It's a, a bratwurst. Okay, sorry. A uh, sausage. A white uh, sausage. Do you also sell the sausage over there? Yes. Okay. Uh, the bratwurst one, the white one? White? Yes. Ketchup, mustard, mayo? Um, just mustard. Hot dog. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Perfect. I, I guess it's a hot dog. I don't know. I'm gonna try this thing too, eh? They cut it and put a big thick piece on the sandwich. It's like cooked bologna. Thank you so much. Danke schön. Here, like, here it is, huh? You wanna try it? Is it hard to bite through? Mm. Mm. It's better than the kebab? Oh my god, yeah. This is my shit. Mm. Oh yeah. Mm. Even the mustard? Yeah. It tastes so good. It oh, tastes shit. good, eh? Oh shit. You like that one? My god, this is a dead. That's a dead. <laughs> you gotta have this. They call this a hot dog. But it's bigger, huh? It's better she said. <laughs> so now we're gonna finish this food tour video. The Bruno Market was a bust. The sausage stand was good. And number one is coming. Number one is coming. And where are we going? To the ship? To the ship or home? To the ship or go? We're going know. to the ship on Danube River. <laughs> you will see. You will see. Where are we going? I want to go. She says she's tired. I want to go. She says she's tired. So let's go. We got to catch the one. Catch the one. Catch the one. Here we go. Now everybody run. Everybody run. Catch the one! Catch the one! We're going to this ship over here with the Christmas lights. And it looks pretty nice. Hopefully we can catch a drink on it. If not, we tried, right? We tried. Yeah. Yeah, so this is end of our day one here. Look at this. Look how cool this looks. End of our first day here in Vienna and it's beautiful nighttime is beautiful we're going to the ship to kill a cocktail or two you know what I mean maybe a brewski ruski for daddy and then we're going back to the room calling night we got to get up go to Bratislava go to Slovakia knock a new country off the list that'll be number 20 and then yeah then come back here spend two more nights three more nights here I think at the Marriott do a Marriott hotel review and this is beautiful this is honestly nice look at this look at this guys 
As you can see, the people are dancing on the boat. We try to get on, but it's a private dance party, I guess. I don't know, I guess they're doing dance lessons, so it's pretty pretty private. You can't get on it, but it's kind of cool. You feel like the ship move and everything, even though it's attached to attached to the wall by some big metal beams. But you can see the metal beams there. But it's a pretty cool place, huh? Too bad. Another day. Maybe. Maybe we get another chance in life, right? Yes, we are coming back soon. Yeah, we're going back soon. Come back in one day, so let's go. Let's get good. Let's, let's get home now. And that's the end of the food video. Now I'm going to smash some drinks at home alone and cry. No, <laughs> but look at the views right here. Yeah, I think the sunset, if next time we can come at the sunset, it will be beautiful. Yeah, it's beautiful here. It's a beautiful city, I would say, overall. Beautiful.